That's how you get the job done. Sorry, Garrus. Sorry, Rex. We're trying a bit harder next time. Okay, just my final charm, and now I should have charm people easier, and I need my bat. Okay. I'm gonna be focusing on my assault rifle. I'm just not good at a sniper rifle, even though I do have training. Okay, let's get your description up. Description up, Garrus. And now we can have Rex's shotgun upgraded. Okay, now you go with that, Rex. Now you are able to use your shotgun, and hopefully you make that a good use. Now let's go inside our mine and find our Asari friend. Doors have opened. What's behind them though? Okay then. There's a pipe right there. Down the tunnel we go, guys. Keep your eyes peeled. Don't know how many there are there. We don't know if they got more of those ghost things. Or I can't. I don't think so. Yeah. Well, that's stuff like that. We don't know what the other surprises basically. There's one more left, I believe. I can just get down there. It'll be easy, easier. And here, little gaffy, gaffy, gaffy. That's right, Rex. Be careful. Doing very well at the moment. I was gonna see if there's anything there as well. Aside from the citadel, I mean. Okay, I believe the Asari should be behind that shield thingy, if I remember correctly. But I might be wrong. Who knows? It's been a while. Oh, Rex. Is it, is it nice having those spikes? Like, spiky kind of thing. I think it's better than here, to be honest. There's so many damage you don't have to worry about styling it, something like that. Oh no, you don't have both drones! I hate drones. Spear them on the side, but not when they are against them. Yeah, back away, back away! Okay, we're dead now. Down we go. Okay, why do I feel like... Why do I have the feeling that this lift is not very good? I need to work on the lifts. God, where are your power supplies, people? Uh, hello? Could somebody help? Why was there like a delay? It comes up and then it tells. Can you hear me out there? I'm trapped, I need help! So I will hear the help, woman. Um, Dr. Sa Tassoni? Liara Tassoni, I no, presume. Liara, Doctor Tassoni. I did not think anyone would come looking for me. Listen, this thing I'm in is a Prothean security device. I cannot move, so I need you to get me out of it. All right? We'll find a way to free you. We just need to figure some way past this energy field. It's a Prothean barrier curtain. I knew it would keep me safe from the Geth. When I turned it on, I must have hit something I wasn't supposed to. I was trapped in here. You must get me out, please. You put this in yourself. What can we do? Stay calm. What can we do? Any suggestions on how we can help? There is a control in here that should deactivate this thing. You'll have to find some way past the barrier curtain. That's the tricky part. The defenses cannot be shut off from the outside. I don't know how you'll get in here. Be careful. There is a Krogan with the Geth. They have been trying different ways to get past the Another barrier. Another Krogan? Maybe Rex could talk to him. That'd be interesting if you have the same species on your team that they could talk to the ones that they're on the enemy and maybe convince them, perhaps. Mm. Oh no, you don't, buddy. Let's get down there. Yeah, <laughs> sorry about that. The controls in this game is okay. Depends really. I think we got to enter that cult. I don't know what we got to do exactly. Yeah. That's not so bad, just one. Yeah, well, it didn't affect him. Probably might actually affect him maybe from distance. Okay, there's another one on here somewhere, I think. I think we're good, Shepard. Well, what was that laser beam thing that target stuff? 
Or was that one of you guys? It's probably Garrus, maybe. I think. Okay, let's go get that that device and see what we can do. Should be some kind of code, perhaps. I think this one we got, just keep trying to figure it out. A. X. So we got to try to remember it every time we make a mistake. A, X, B. Yeah, that's not bad. That's, not, that's pretty simple, really. I don't know if it's exactly like that, but if it is, just do exactly how I did this then. Otherwise, just keep on doing it to you, like... Like, just keep doing it until you got it wrong, but remember what you did was right before, and then keep on repeating it until you get the right one. That's what I suggest. If that makes any sense. Why doesn't? I don't know. Wow, Rex. Nice, um... I don't know what to talk about with these guys' heads. <laughs> They're very pointy. Oh, how did you get in here? I didn't think there was any way past the barrier. Wait, what wrong? Carry a firepower. It was easy. We blasted through with the mining laser. Of course. Yes, that makes sense. Please, get me out of here before more Geth arrive. That button over there should shut down this containment field. Not so fast, Shepard. You sure she's on our side? Her mother's working with Sarah. That's a good point. I am not my mother. I don't even... I don't know why Benezia joined Saren. I don't want anything to do with that Turian bastard. Okay, let her out. We need her. I believe her. If she was with Saren, the Geth wouldn't be trying to kill her. That is her. true. Sorry, just because a mother turns evil does not mean she'll turn evil. That's like saying if your mother turns evil, you're, you turn evil. It makes no sense, you know? Everyone's their own mind. Depends on what you what you're gonna do with it. Place? There is an elevator back in the center of the tower. At least I I think it's an elevator. It should take us out of here. Come on. Okay. We should be able to choose now. I I still cannot believe all this. Why would the Geth come after me? Do you think Benezia's involved? I was hoping you would know why. Saren's looking for the conduit. You're a Prothean expert. Obviously, he wants you to help him find it. The conduit, but I don't know. Why are you looking? What the hell was that? These ruins are not stable. That mining laser must have triggered a seismic event. Oh. We have to hurry. The whole place is caving in. We need an escape plan. Joker, get the Normandy airborne and lock in on my signal. On the double, mister. Aye, aye, Commander. Secure and away. ETA eight minutes. If I die in here, I'll kill him. <laughs> So will I, so will I. We'll both, we'll both of us want to haunt Chip forever, tormenting Joker. Joker, it was your fault that we're dead because you're slow. Joker. Oh God, every time. God. I don't want to do a voice attempt now. Batman now. I feel I'd be very good at Batman. Joker. Joker. Okay, Rex, can you talk with this Krogan for us? Maybe, perhaps. Brenda, if you don't, that would be more fun. The ruins coming down. In case you didn't notice, this place is falling apart. Exhilarating, isn't it? Thanks for getting rid of those energy fields for us. Had the doctor over. Whatever it is you want, you are not getting it from me. Why'd you want to fight now? Is this really the time? There's rocks falling for the ceiling, yeah, so perfect for our life and death struggle. It's not a good idea. Kill them. Spare the Asari if you can. Not doesn't matter. Take this. Okay, we, we focus on the battle master last. Let's kill those easy ones first to get him out of the way. Do the high backup. Uh, we just have two level up. We don't have one. Get rid of him now since he finds himself. Back on. Okay, we got him. Finally. We need to get a shield down somehow. What are we gonna do? Move it, shoot. Move it, move it. 
this is definitely not a safe place. There's all the hub inspector right now. The hub and city inspector. I'd be like, okay, the place is going to be closed down. It's too dangerous. No. Actually, we do that well. It's like, yes. Soka gas, ship ready. Well, that went. That could have went better. It wasn't so bad, but could have gone better. Too close, Commander. Ten more seconds we would have been swimming in molten sulfur. The Normandy isn't equipped to land in exploding volcanoes. They tend to fry our sensors and melt our hull. Just for future reference. Okay. We almost died out there and your pilot is making jokes? Sometimes Joker's a real ass. Just try to ignore him. I see. It must be a human thing. Kind of. I don't have a lot of experience dealing with your species, Commander. But I am grateful to you. You saved my life back there, and not just from the volcano. Those Geth would have killed me or dragged me off to Saren. What did Saren want with you? Do you know something about the conduit? Do you? Only that it was somehow connected to the Prothean extinction. That is my real area of expertise. I have spent the past 50 years trying to figure out what happened to them. Uh, what did you learn? Did your research turn up anything interesting? What is interesting is what I did not turn up. There is remarkably little archaeological evidence of the Protheans, and even less that might explain why they disappeared. It is almost as if someone did not want the mystery solved. It is like someone came along after the Protheans were gone and cleansed the galaxy of clues. That seems but what here it's is like. the incredible yeah. part. According to my findings, the Protheans were not the first galactic civilization to mysteriously vanish. This cycle began long before them. If the Protheans weren't the first, then who was? I don't know. There is barely any evidence on the Protheans, even less on those who came before them. I cannot prove my theory, but I know I am right. The galaxy is built on a cycle of extinction. Each time a great civilization rises up, it is suddenly and violently cast down. Only ruins survive. The Protheans rose up from a single world until their empire spanned the entire galaxy. Yet even they climbed to the top on the remains of those who came before. Their greatest achievements, the mass relays and the citadel, are based on the technology of those who came before them. Hmm. And then, like all the other forgotten civilizations throughout galactic history, the Protheans disappeared. I have dedicated my life to figuring out why. Okay, I know what happened. They were wiped out by a race of sentient machines. The Reapers. The... the Reapers? But I have never heard of... How do you know this? What evidence do you have? A vision. There was a damaged Prothean beacon on Eden Prime. It burned a vision into my brain. I'm still trying to sort out what it all means. Visions? Yes, that makes sense. The beacons were designed to transmit information directly into the mind of the user. Finding one that still works is extremely rare. No wonder the Geth attacked Eden Prime. The chance to acquire a working beacon, even a badly damaged one, is worth almost any risk. Hmm. But the beacons were only programmed to interact with Prothean physiology. Whatever information you received would have been confused, unclear. I am amazed you were able to make sense of it at all. A lesser mind would have been utterly destroyed by the process. You must be remarkably strong-willed, Commander. I thank you. This isn't helping us find Saren, or the Conduit. Of course, you are right. I am sorry, my scientific curiosity got the better of me. Unfortunately, I do not have any information that could help you find the Conduit, or Saren. I don't know why Saren wanted you out of the picture, but I think we'll be a lot better off if we bring you along. Thank you, Commander. I agree, we do need her. Saren might come after me again. I cannot think of anywhere safer than here on your ship. And my knowledge of the Protheans might be useful later on. And her biotics will come in handy when the fighting starts. 
Good to have you on the team, Liara. Thank you, Commander. I am very grateful. Always good to have an extra hand. Oh, I am afraid I am feeling a bit lightheaded. When was the last time you ate or slept? Dr. Chakwa should take a look at you. It is probably yeah, just she should mental check on you exhaustion, in case. coupled with the shock of discovering the Protheans' true fate. I need some time to process all this. Still, it could not hurt to be examined by a medical professional. It will give me the chance to think things over. Are we finished here, Commander? We can talk again after you've seen the doctor. The rest of you, dismissed. Mission reports are filed, Commander. You want me to patch you through to the council? Yes. Patch him through, Joker. Setting up the link now, Commander. I'm curious what the council is going to say about this. We've received your report, Commander. I understand Dr. Tassoni is on the Normandy. I assume you're taking the necessary security precautions. Don't tell me how to do my job. You are free to act as you see fit, Commander. Our role is to offer guidance and advice. It's up to you if you're smart enough to listen. Liara's on our side. The Geth were trying to kill her. Benezia would never allow Saren to kill her daughter. Maybe she doesn't know. That's a possibility. Or maybe we don't know her. We never expected she could become a traitor. At least the mission was a success. Apart from the utter destruction of a major Prothean ruin. Was that really necessary, Shepard? It was. I, I, how did I have any control over that? The Geth were crawling all over those ruins. We were lucky to make it out alive. Of course, Commander. The mission must always take priority. Good luck, Commander. Remember, we are all counting on you. I'm like to... Uh, Charles, I kind of feel like he should be trying to be expected and see what happens, you know? It's not as easy as he thinks it is. Okay then, let's we'll go see if we can talk to anyone about what happened. It's always good to do this after a mission, because you never know what kind of conversations you have unlocked afterwards, because it all depends really. The more progress you do, the more chance you have an interesting conversation. Unlock um, more of a story, I'd say. Let's we'll see what Kay has got to say. Commander? Do you have a minute? I always make time for my officers. Off the record, I think there's something wrong here. This Saren is looking for records on some kind of galactic extinction, but we can't get backup from the council? Sorry, Commander. There's writing on the wall here, but someone isn't reading it. I hear you. The council doesn't want to believe anything's wrong. I'd call it human nature, but... I hear you. It, it just seems like a group that's been around as long as the council should see this coming. And it's funny, we finally get out here and the final frontier was already settled. And the residents don't even seem impressed by the view. Or the dangers. Well, well. You're a romantic. Did you sign on for the dream, Alenko? Secure a man's future in yeah, space? Yeah, I don't want her to date him. <laughs> If I can't yeah, date I someone, it's gonna be dating a girl on this. A hero goes to space to prove himself worthy of a woman he loves, or you know, for justice. Now, maybe I was a romantic in the beginning, but I thought about it after brain camp. Uh, sorry, biotic acclimation and temperance training. I'm not looking for the dream. I just want to do some good. See what's out here. Sorry if I got too informal. Protocol wasn't a big focus back in Bot. What did they train for you for? Tell me about it. Biotic acclimation and temperance didn't last past the airlock. To the kids they hauled in, it was brain camp. Sorry, hauled in is unkind. We were encouraged to commit to an evaluation of our abilities so an understanding of biotics could be compiled. There are worse results of accidental exposure to element zero in the womb. Beats the brain tumors some kids grew up with. Is there some question about how you were exposed? My mother was downwind of a transport crash. It was before there were human biotics, a little after the discovery of the Martian ruins. It only gets iffy around 63 when Kinetics was running out of first-gen subjects. Until then, they'd relied on accidentals. 
bunch of guys in suits show up at your door after school, and next thing you know, you're out on Jump Zero. Sounds rough. Jump Zero is a long way from home. What was it like? The Grand Gateway to Humanity looks a lot better in the vids. Anyway, this was supposed to be a casual debrief, not a bull session about stuff that happened years ago. I wanted to get to know you a little better. That's all. Thanks for the talk, Caden. Well, you're welcome, ma'am. You, uh, make a habit of getting this personal with everyone? To some degree. Um, to some degree. Of course. But I don't enjoy it with everyone. We'll talk again later. I'll, uh, I'll need some time to process that, Commander. But Don't look into it. Yeah, I'd like that. Okay, okay, okay. We're not gonna talk too much, man. You're, I don't want me and you getting connected. No, thank you. 